Ready with my hands? I'll do that. George! <laughs> <laughs> it's not working. <laughs> hey, Lily, can you hear me? <laughs> All right, we're here. <laughs>here at the Carl Samer College basketball camp speaking with Noah Pepper. Noah, what was your favorite drill at camp this week? Defense slide. Defensive slides. Do you feel like you're a good defensive player? Kind of. Kind of. What's your favorite part of defense? Would it be rebounding, getting steals, or not letting people score? Steals. Steals. Well, there you have it. That's Noah Pepper from the Carl Samer College basketball camp. I'm here with Dominic Cantorini at the Carl Sandburg College basketball camp. Dominic, what other sports do you play? I, I play track and field, soccer, baseball, cooks and one, and that's about it. I heard you say track and field. Are you a sprinter or are you more of a distance runner? I'm a distance. I run 1,600. Wow. What is your fastest 1,600 time? Six. Six minutes, 31 seconds. And there you have it. That's Dominic Cantorini from the Carl Samber College basketball camp. Hi, I'm here with George Brown at the Carl Samber College basketball camp. George, what was your favorite part of camp this week? Um, everything, really. I everything? Like did, you, did you like the offense and the shooting more, or were you more of a defensive guy? Um, offense. Offense. Offense is always more fun than defense, right? Yeah. So, George, you, you're, you're a tall kid. Are you, do you consider yourself more of a guard or a center? Um, anything. Anything? And, and that, that's the way basketball is going. No positions. That's always good. So there you have it. That's George Brown from the Carl Sandburg College basketball camp. Test, test, test. Oh, gosh. Hi. All right, we're back at the Carl Sandburg College basketball camp 2017. We are here with Talia Galloway. Uh, Talia, what would you think of the camp this week? It was fun. It was fun. Who made you do more sit-ups, Coach Twaddle or Coach Bailey? Coach Bailey. I totally disagree. Talia, you're right in line to be the free throw champion of the week. What would you attribute your shooting success from the charity stripe? Is it your form or your concentration? What's the most important part of your free throw shooting? Concentration. Did you meet any new friends here this week? Yeah. Yeah? Who? Who? Basically all of them. Basically all of them? Did you know any of them going into the week? Yes. Okay, very good. So making new friends and learning how to shoot free throws has been a great week. Yes. Anything else you'd like to add about your experience? No. Talia, it's been a real pleasure to see you perform here at the Sandberg Basketball Camp. Thank you for coming. You're welcome. <laughs> Very good. All right, we're here at the Carl Sandberg Basketball Camp 2017. We're with Kara Kilgore. Uh, Kara, why did you choose to do the CSC Basketball Camp, and did you enjoy it? I decided to do the camp because Coach Baylor is my dad's coach in college, and if anybody else could help fine-tune my skills before I go to nationals, he could. And yes, I did enjoy it. I had a couple of knowledgeable guys help improve my game. That's a very professional answer. We truly appreciate that. Uh, you have been uh, shooting the ball very well this week in, in camp. Uh, what do you attribute your success to? concentration. You have been doing a great job of that all week. Uh, I do have one more question for you, and, and this goes directly to our audience. Uh, Miss Kilgore, what's it, what grade are you in? Sixth. As a sixth grader, what's it like to already be the best basketball player in your family? I'm not, though. <laughs> well, as Coach Twaddle and I assess the week at camp, we determined that you are already the best player in your family. So uh, keep up the great work, 
And uh, where is your national tournament at? Cincinnati, Ohio. Yeah, when do you leave to go to that? Wednesday. And who are you playing with? Um, my HOI team. Okay, and, and where is that out of? Peoria. Very good. Well, Miss Kilgore, you have a great future ahead of you, and uh, congratulations on a great week and the best of luck at Nationals. Thank you. Back at the Sandberg basketball camp, we're here with Lauren Zuko. Lauren, where are you from? Abingdon, Illinois. And what grade will you be entering next year? Six. Uh, what did you enjoy about the camp this week, Lauren? Um, mostly just practicing basketball and getting better and meeting a bunch of new cool kids. There is a lot of cool kids here, isn't there? I think one of the things that impressed the coaches the most was uh, how hard you're working at the new sh shooting form that uh, Coach Twaddle and, and uh, Coach Bailey showed you this week. Uh, do you think that will help you be successful in the coming years? Definitely. Yeah? And what else did you find enjoyable about the camp? Um, well, the coaches. Really Coach awesome. Bailey especially? Maybe. Maybe. <laughs> and it was Coach Twaddle that made you guys do all the sit-ups, correct? No. No? It was you. <laughs> I totally, I think I disagree with that comment. Uh, you have a little friendly, uh, you, you have a little friendly rivalry with uh, your sister. Can you explain a little bit about that for us, please? Well, <laughs> it's, it's not really a rivalry. It's just... We actually get along really well, and we're hoping to share a room together uh, in our basement one day. And I guess we just do it to bother each other and tease each other. Well, you're both very competitive kids, and it's been a real pleasure having you at camp, Lauren. Thank you for coming. Thank you. We're back at the Carl Samber College basketball camp. I'm here with Caitlin Zuko. Caitlin, what was your favorite thing about camp this week? All of it. All of it? You had a pretty intense rivalry with your sister all week. Did, do you think you guys can still be friends? Well, yeah, of course. I mean, we kind of have to be. <laughs> well, that's good. Do you consider your sister to be your best friend? Sometimes. <laughs> <laughs> Sounds like a nice rivalry to have. What grade are you going into next year? Eighth. Eighth grade. And what team do you play for? Um, Abingdon Avon Tornadoes. Gotcha. Well, thank you. We enjoyed having you at camp all week, and good luck to you next season. Brady! Brady! <laughs> <laughs> We're here at the Carl Seamer College basketball camp with, with Lily Pepper. Lily, what did you enjoy about camp this week? Um, the water breaks. You enjoyed the water breaks? <laughs> So that means that you worked really hard and got, you, you did the drills so hard, you are always so tired you needed water. Would that be correct? Yeah. Lily, who made you do all the sit-ups this week? Was it me or was it Coach Bailey? Coach Bailey. <laughs> was Co Coach Bailey, he was, he was great to have in camp this week, but he was a little mean, wasn't he? He made us do sit-ups. <laughs> <laughs> and Lily, I noticed you, you and your brother, Noah, it had a big rivalry going on all week. Can you two still be friends even after camp? No. No? You don't think you and your brother can make up after such intense competition? No, we never do. <laughs> and there you have it. That's Lily Pepper at the Carl Samer College basketball camp. <laughs> I'm here with Brady Warner at the Carl Samer College basketball camp. Brady, what do you feel like you've improved upon the most in the last couple of years of basketball? Probably my shooting. Your shooting? I noticed you didn't miss any layups all week in, in camp. Did you earn, you, you clearly earned the nickname Brady, can't miss layups, Warner. No, I'm a 
missed a few. You missed a few. Well, no one was looking when you missed those. Do you have any other nicknames besides Brady Can't Miss Layups Warner? Bear. Bear? How would you get the nickname Bear? My dad just always called me it. That's nice. What grade are you going into, Brady? Seventh. Seventh. And what team do you play for? Future Streaks and Churchill Junior High. Gotcha. Well, good luck next year. We enjoyed having you at camp. That's Brady Warner from the Carl Samer College basketball camp. We're here at the Carl Samer College basketball camp with Kalen Warner. Um, and Kalen, you missed a couple days of camp this week, uh, not feeling well. How are you feeling now? Much better. Much better. Um, Kalen, uh, what, what other sports do you play? Because you, you have an intensity about you, and I'm sure that you play other sports. I play softball and volleyball. Ah, what positions do you play in softball? Well, I play everywhere, but I'm mainly a pitcher. Mainly a pitcher. Everybody needs pitching, right? Okay, what would you think of the camp this week? I liked it when I was here. <laughs> yeah, and uh, I noticed that you have a tendency to pick on your little brother. Is uh, Does that carry on off the court, or is that just on the court, or does that happen at home as well? It happens at home. Yeah, and uh, does he do the picking on you, or do you pick on him? It's both of us. It's both of us? And how do your parents take care of that situation? We get in trouble. You get in trouble. Very good. Well, you didn't get in trouble this week during camp, and we appreciate you coming. Thank you. Thank you. We're here uh, staring at the back crew. We've got a room full of media here, a lot of cred media credentials here. We've got radio. We've got TV. We have bloggers. And they all came to talk to Addison Anderson and see what she had to say. Uh, Addison, what's it like being in the spotlight here at the Carl Sandberg College Basketball Camp? Okay. Just another day in the life? Kind of. Kind of? What would make today better? I don't know. Do you always show this much enthusiasm when, when all these folks came to watch you and listen to you? Sometimes. Sometimes. Uh, I noticed you practicing your layups a lot when we were had some downtime at camp. Uh, did you feel like you got any better this week at your layups? Yes. What other parts of the camp did you like, Addison? Everything. I mean, your enthusiasm is over, over, just overwhelming all of us. What other parts did you like about the camp? Everything. And you came with two friends, I believe, from Abingdon. Is that correct? Yes. Well, ladies and gentlemen, with Addison Anderson, Abney and Avon basketball has a very bright future. Thanks for coming to the camp, Addison. Thank you for coaching. Thank you. We're at the Carl Samer College basketball camp with Jackson Hillhouse. Jackson, how long have you been playing basketball? Um, seven to six years. Seven to six years. And how did you learn how to play? Did, did a coach get you into the game, a parent, a friend? Um, pretty much both. Pretty much both? That's good. I noticed this week you had a three-point celebration in practice whenever you made a three. And you made a lot of them. Can you show the world the celebration that you have? You do the, you do the three goggles like this. Or and you can reverse it. Oh, and you can reverse it? <laughs> yeah. So you have two celebrations. Yeah, basically. So... How did you learn your three-point celebration? Mm, just picked it off TV and stuck. There you go. That's Jackson House from the Carl Samer College basketball camp. We're with Jackson House at the Carl Samer College basketball camp. Jackson, what was your favorite drill this week? I'm here so I just don't get fined. Okay, Jackson, what did you like most about camp this week? I'm just here... Wait, I forgot it. What was it? <laughs> I'm here, so I don't get fun. I'm, I'm just here. here. I'm just here. So I don't get fun. So I don't get okay. Yep. Here. We're here at Jackson Hillhouse at the Carl Samberg College basketball camp. Jackson, what was your favorite part about camp this week? I'm just here so I don't get fined. Jackson, I, I know that you, you have to be here, but can, can you just give us an answer on what your favorite part of camp was? I'm just here so I don't get fined. Jackson, I, you notice you're a good teammate. And um, did you enjoy uh, any of the other campers this week? I'm just here so I don't get fined. 
Well, I, I don't think we're getting anywhere, so we'll go back to you. Lily, we noticed a couple times during drills that you just didn't seem to be concentrating very well or maybe giving 100% effort. Can you tell us what's going on out there? I forgot it. Lily, we noticed a couple times this week uh, when we were doing drills that uh, your concentration wasn't the best and maybe your effort wasn't quite there. Can you, uh, can you explain what was going on at that time? It's not a game, man. It's just camp. Well, I, I, I understand that, but uh, when you're playing basketball, you, you need to give a great effort all the time. Uh, how do you explain that? It's not a game, man. It's just camp. <laughs> Are, are we going to see better effort out of you uh, in the future uh, basketball camps here at Carl Sandburg College? It's not a game. It's just camp. It's not a game, ladies and gentlemen. It's just camp, man.